Welcome to a breath of fresh air, the top five house blends to purify your home and lift your spirits. In this green-filled journey, we'll explore the captivating world of house blends and uncover their incredible benefits. Get ready to transform your living space into a vibrant oasis with the top contenders for your indoor garden. We'll kick off our botanical adventure with the magnificent snake plant. Known for its striking appearance and air purifying abilities, this resilient beauty will captivate your senses. Learn about its unique description and characteristics, and discover expert tips for successful growth and care. We'll also introduce you to a variety of captivating options, while ensuring you're aware of any precautions. Next up is the spider plant, a popular choice among indoor gardeners. With its cascading foliage and air cleansing prowess, it brings a touch of elegance to any space. Dive into its fascinating features, uncover the secrets to its successful cultivation and explore a range of enticing varieties. We'll also provide you with important information to ensure you enjoy its benefits safely. As we continue our journey, we'll delve into the enchanting world of pothos. This versatile and low-maintenance plant will win your heart with its trailing vines and lush green leaves. Discover its unique description and characteristics, unlock the secrets to its thriving growth, and explore a diverse selection of varieties. We'll also guide you on how to care for it responsibly. Prepare to meet the resilient ZZ plant, a true gem in the world of houseplants. Its glossy foliage and ability to thrive in various conditions make it a favorite among plant enthusiasts. Uncover the distinctive features that make the ZZ plant stand out, gain insights into its care requirements, and explore different varieties that will suit your style. Last but not least, we'll introduce you to the elegant Chinese Evergreen. With its striking patterns and adaptability, it's a true showstopper. Learn about its unique description and characteristics, unlock the secrets to its successful care, and explore a range of breathtaking varieties. We'll also ensure you're aware of any considerations to ensure a harmonious relationship with this exquisite plant. Along the way, we'll address common houseplant problems and provide practical solutions to help you overcome any challenges. You'll also find a wealth of resources for further learning and exploration, allowing you to expand your green knowledge. Get ready to embark on a botanical adventure that will uplift your space, purify your air, and nourish your soul. A breath of fresh air will guide you every step of the way, ensuring your houseplant journey is filled with joy, success, and a touch of natural beauty. Houseplants are not just a trendy home decor element. They also offer a variety of benefits to their owners. Studies have shown that indoor plants have the ability to improve air quality by reducing levels of toxins such as benzene and formaldehyde. They also increase humidity, which can help with respiratory issues and dry skin. In addition, houseplants have been linked to reduce stress levels and improved mood, making them a great addition to any living space. Not only do they bring a touch of nature indoors, but they can also enhance the overall ambience of a room, providing a sense of calm and relaxation. Houseplants do more than just add aesthetic appeal to your home. These living organisms have been proven to provide a range of physical and mental health benefits. One of the most well-known benefits of houseplants is their ability to purify the air. Plants are natural air filters, and they absorb toxins and chemicals from the air through their leaves, roots, and soil. This process, known as phytoremediation, can improve indoor air quality and reduce the risk of respiratory problems. Houseplants also have a positive effect on mental health. Studies have shown that being around plants can reduce stress levels, improve mood, and increase productivity. In addition, caring for plants can be therapeutic and help reduce symptoms of depression and anxiety. Another benefit of houseplants is that they can improve sleep quality. Certain plants, such as lavender and jasmine, have a calming effect and can promote relaxation. This can lead to a better night's sleep and improved overall health. Overall, adding houseplants to your home can provide a range of health benefits. Not only do they improve air quality, but they can also promote mental well-being and lead to a better night's sleep. Indoor gardening has become increasingly popular in recent years, and for good reason. With more people living in urban areas and apartments with limited outdoor space, indoor gardening provides a way to connect with nature and grow plants in a small space. There are several reasons why indoor gardening has become so popular. 1. Urbanization. As more people move into cities and urban areas, access to green spaces and nature can be limited. Indoor gardening allows people to create their own green oasis in their homes, regardless of where they live. 2. Wellness and well-being. Many people are looking for ways to reduce stress, improve their mood, and promote a sense of calm in their daily lives. Houseplants have been shown to have a positive impact on mental health and can help to create a soothing and relaxing environment in the home. 
3. Sustainability With growing concerns about the environment and the impact of human activity on the planet, many people are looking for ways to live more sustainably. Indoor gardening can be a way to grow your own food, reduce your carbon footprint, and connect with nature in a meaningful way. 4. Social media The rise of social media platforms like Instagram and Pinterest has also contributed to the popularity of indoor gardening. Beautiful photos of plants and plant-filled homes are often shared on these platforms, inspiring others to start their own indoor gardens. Snake plants, also known as mother-in-law's tongue, are a popular houseplant due to their hardy nature and low maintenance requirements. The plant's striking upright leaves come in various shades of green, often with white or yellow variegation. The snake plant is native to West Africa and is known for its air-purifying properties, making it a perfect addition to any home or office environment. Description and Characteristics The snake plant gets its name from the long, slender, and pointed leaves that resemble a snake's skin. The plant can grow up to three feet tall, with the leaves growing in a rosette pattern. The leaves of the snake plant are thick and succulent, which makes them resistant to drought and low humidity. The plant is also known for its unique ability to convert CO2 to oxygen during the night, making it an ideal plant to have in bedrooms. Growing and Caring Tips Snake plants are one of the easiest houseplants to care for, making them perfect for beginners. They can grow in a wide range of light conditions, from bright indirect light to low light, making them versatile in terms of placement in your home. However, they prefer indirect light to avoid burning their leaves. When it comes to watering, the snake plant prefers to be on the drier side, so it's best to let the soil dry out before watering again. Overwatering can lead to root rot and other fungal diseases. In the winter, the plant's growth slows down, so watering should be reduced accordingly. The snake plant is a slow grower, so it's unlikely to outgrow its pot quickly. However, if the plant does outgrow its pot, repotting is best done in the spring or summer. The plant can be propagated by separating the roots and replanting them in a new pot. Varieties to choose from There are several varieties of snake plants to choose from, each with its own unique characteristics. Some popular varieties include Sansevieria trifasciata laurentii. This variety has yellow-edged leaves, adding a pop of color to any room. Sansevieria trifasciata moonshine. This variety has silvery green leaves that add a modern touch to any decor. Sansevieria trifasciata futura superba. This variety has wider leaves than other snake plants and is known for its bold and beautiful variegation. Contraindications. Snake plant is generally considered a safe plant to have indoors. However, it is important to note that the plant can be mildly toxic to pets and humans if ingested. The leaves of the snake plant contain saponins, which can cause stomach upset, nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea in pets and humans if ingested in large quantities. Ingestion of the plant is not usually fatal, but it can cause discomfort and should be avoided. It's also important to note that snake plant may cause allergic reactions in some individuals who are sensitive to plant allergens. Symptoms of an allergic reaction may include itching, rash, or difficulty breathing. If you are allergic to other plants, it's best to avoid snake plant or handle it with caution. Snake plants are one of the best indoor plants for those looking for a low-maintenance plant with unique characteristics. With proper care and attention, the snake plant can thrive in any home or office environment, adding a touch of natural beauty to your space. Pothos, also known as Devil's Ivy, is a versatile and popular houseplant with attractive foliage that can liven up any space. It belongs to the family of Eris and is native to Southeast Asia, Indonesia, and Australia. It is an easy-to-care-for plant that can thrive in a wide range of conditions making it a perfect choice for beginners and experienced plant enthusiasts alike. Description and Characteristics Pothos is a vine plant that grows quickly and can trail down from shelves or hanging baskets. It has heart-shaped leaves that come in a variety of colors, including green, yellow, and variegated combinations. Its foliage is glossy, which makes it a great plant for adding some shine to your indoor space. The plant can grow up to 20 meters in the wild, but when grown indoors, it usually reaches a maximum length of 3 meters. Growing and caring tips, Pothos is an easy care plant that can tolerate low to bright light conditions, making it a great option for those who do not have a lot of natural light in their homes. It prefers well-draining soil that is rich in organic matter, and it should be watered when the soil is dry to the touch. Overwatering can lead to root rot, so it's important not to let the plant sit in standing water. Pothos is also a plant that responds well to pruning. Regular pruning will help maintain its shape and promote new growth. You can use the cuttings to propagate new plants, making it an excellent choice for those who want to expand their plant collection without spending too much money. Varieties to choose from There are many varieties of pothos to choose from, each with its unique characteristics. The most popular varieties include Golden Pothos This variety has green and yellow variegated leaves and is the most common pothos variety. Marble Queen Pothos This variety has green and white variegated leaves and is slightly more sensitive to light than the Golden Pothos. Neon Pothos This variety has bright neon green leaves that can add a pop of color to any room. 
Jade Pothos. This variety has solid green leaves and is less common than the other varieties. Contraindications. Pothos can be toxic if ingested, particularly to pets and children, as it contains calcium oxalate crystals that can cause irritation and swelling in the mouth, throat, and digestive tract. It is important to keep pothos plants out of reach of pets and children, and to wash your hands thoroughly after handling the plant to avoid any potential skin irritation. Overall, pothos is an excellent choice for those looking for an easy-to-care-for plant that can add a touch of greenery to their indoor space. With its attractive foliage and tolerance for a wide range of growing conditions, pothos is a versatile and rewarding plant to have in your collection. Spider plants are known for their long, slender leaves that grow in a cascading pattern, earning them the nickname airplane plants. These popular houseplants are easy to grow and care for, making them a great choice for beginners and experienced plant parents alike. Description and Characteristics Spider plants are native to South Africa and belong to the Asparagaceae family. They can grow up to two feet in height and have long, narrow leaves that can be green or variegated with white stripes. They produce small white flowers that develop into baby spider plants, or plantlets, which can be propagated to create new plants. One of the unique characteristics of spider plants is their ability to improve indoor air quality by removing harmful toxins such as formaldehyde, xylene, and toluene. They are also known to be safe for pets, making them a great choice for households with furry friends. Growing and caring tips. Spider plants are relatively low maintenance and can thrive in a variety of environments. They prefer bright, indirect light but can also tolerate lower light conditions. They should be watered regularly, but the soil should be allowed to dry out slightly between waterings to prevent overwatering. Spider plants can also benefit from occasional fertilization with a balanced fertilizer. They are sensitive to fluoride, so it's best to use distilled or filtered water for watering. Varieties to choose from. Spider plants come in a variety of cultivars, each with its own unique characteristics. Some popular varieties include 1. Chlorophytum camassum variegatum. This variety has green and white striped leaves and is one of the most commonly grown spider plant cultivars. 2. Chlorophytum camassum bonnie. This cultivar has compact growth and curly leaves, giving it a unique appearance. 3. Chlorophytum camassum Hawaiian. This variety has wider leaves than other spider plants and is known for its bold, tropical appearance. Contraindications. Some people may be allergic to the plant or its sap, which can cause skin irritation or respiratory problems in some cases. If you notice any adverse reactions, it is best to remove the plant from your home and seek medical attention if necessary. Overall, spider plants are a great addition to any indoor space due to their ease of care air purifying abilities, and attractive appearance. With proper care, they can thrive for years and produce numerous plantlets for propagation. Zamiacolca zamifolia, commonly known as the ZZ plant or Zanzibar gem, is a popular houseplant that is loved for its attractive foliage and low-maintenance nature. Native to eastern Africa, specifically Zanzibar, Tanzania, and Kenya, the ZZ plant has gained popularity worldwide due to its ability to thrive in various indoor conditions. Description and characteristics, the ZZ plant, also known as the Zanzibar gem or the Eternity plant, is a low-maintenance houseplant with dark green, glossy leaves that can grow up to three feet long. Originally from East Africa, it is a slow-growing plant that can live for many years with proper care. The ZZ plant is also known for its air-purifying properties, making it a great addition to any indoor environment. Growing and caring tips, the ZZ plant is relatively easy to care for and can thrive in a variety of light conditions. It prefers bright, indirect light but can also tolerate low light environments. The ZZ plant also prefers to dry out between waterings, so be sure to let the soil dry out completely before watering again. Overwatering can lead to root rot, so it's important to avoid keeping the soil constantly moist. ZZ plants prefer warm temperatures, ideally between 60 and 75 degrees Fahrenheit. Varieties to choose from, the ZZ plant is typically sold as a single variety, but there are a few variations to choose from. The most common variation is the Raven ZZ plant, which has black foliage that contrasts beautifully with its bright green new growth. Another variation is the Zenzi ZZ plant, which has smaller leaves and a more compact growth habit. Whatever variation you choose, the ZZ plant is a great choice for those looking for an easy-to-care-for plant that can add a touch of tropical flair to any indoor space. Contraindications The ZZ plant is considered non-toxic to humans and animals, and there are no known contraindications associated with its care and maintenance. However, like any plant, it is always recommended to keep it out of reach of children and pets to avoid accidental ingestion or choking hazards. Additionally, handling the plant may cause skin irritation or allergic reactions in some individuals, so it is advisable to wear gloves while pruning or repotting the ZZ plant. The Chinese Evergreen, scientifically known as Aglaonema, is a beautiful and popular houseplant known for its attractive foliage and ability to thrive in low-light conditions. Native to tropical and subtropical regions of Southeast Asia, the Chinese evergreen has become a favorite choice for indoor gardening enthusiasts worldwide. 
Description and Characteristics Chinese Evergreen is a versatile and easy-to-grow houseplant that can add beauty to any room. Its attractive foliage comes in a range of colors and patterns, including silver, green, pink, and red, making it a popular choice for those who want to add a splash of color to their indoor space. Chinese evergreen plants are native to the tropical and subtropical regions of Asia and are also known for their air purifying qualities, which can improve the overall air quality in your home. Growing and Caring Tips Chinese evergreens thrive in bright, indirect light but can also tolerate low light conditions, making them a great choice for any room in your home. They prefer well-draining soil that is kept consistently moist but not soggy, and can be sensitive to overwatering. Allow the top inch of soil to dry out between waterings and avoid letting the plant sit in standing water, which can lead to root rot. Chinese evergreens also benefit from regular fertilization during the growing season, which can help promote healthy growth and foliage. Use a balanced fertilizer every 2-4 weeks during the growing season, and reduce fertilization in the winter when growth slows. Varieties to choose from there are numerous varieties of Chinese evergreens to choose from, each with its own unique foliage, color, and pattern. Some popular varieties include the Silver Bay, which has green leaves with silver markings, the Red Emerald, which has dark green leaves with red veins, and the Maria, which has green leaves with white and silver markings. Other varieties to consider include the Silver Queen, the Harlequin, and the Cutlass. With so many options available, you are sure to find a Chinese evergreen that fits your style and preferences. Contraindications Chinese evergreen is generally considered safe for humans and pets, and there are no significant contraindications associated with it. However, as with any houseplant, ingestion of the leaves or stems may cause gastrointestinal upset, so it's important to keep it out of reach of children and pets. Additionally, some people may experience skin irritation or an allergic reaction when handling the plant, so wearing gloves while pruning or repotting is recommended. It's also worth noting that although Chinese evergreen is not toxic to cats and dogs, it may still cause mild irritation or vomiting if ingested in large amounts. Congratulations! You've made it to the end of your houseplant journey. By now, you should have a good understanding of the benefits of houseplants, the rise of indoor gardening, and the top 5 houseplants to consider for your indoor garden. However, before we wrap up, let's touch on a few final thoughts, common houseplant problems and solutions, and resources for further learning and exploration. Common houseplant problems and solutions. No matter how much you care for your plants, issues can arise. Here are some of the most common houseplant problems and solutions. 1. Overwatering. Overwatering is one of the most common mistakes new plant parents make. It can lead to root rot, which can be fatal for your plant. To avoid overwatering, make sure the soil is dry to the touch before watering, and always use a well-draining potting mix. 2. Underwatering Just like overwatering, underwatering can harm your plants. Signs of underwatering include wilting, yellowing leaves, and dry soil. To remedy this, water your plants thoroughly and consistently. You can also consider using a moisture meter to ensure you're giving your plants the right amount of water. 3. Pests Pests such as spider mites, mealybugs, and scale insects can infest your plants and cause damage. The best way to prevent pests is to inspect your plants regularly and isolate any affected ones. You can also use organic pest control methods such as neem oil or insecticidal soap. 4. Low humidity Many houseplants come from tropical climates and require high humidity levels to thrive. If the air in your home is dry, your plants may suffer from brown leaf tips or stunted growth. To increase humidity, consider using a humidifier, placing a tray of water near your plants, or grouping your plants together. 5. Lack of light. Plants need light to grow, and a lack of it can cause them to become leggy or drop leaves. If your plants aren't getting enough light, consider moving them closer to a window or investing in grow lights. Your houseplant journey doesn't have to end here. There are countless resources available to help you expand your knowledge and explore new plant species. Here are a few resources to consider. 1. Online forums. Online forums such as Reddit's R, Houseplants or Facebook groups like Houseplant Hobbyist offer a community of fellow plant lovers to share tips and advice with. 2. Books. There are countless books available on houseplant care and species identification. Some popular titles include The Joy of Plants by Daryl Chang and The Complete Houseplant Survival Manual by Barbara Pleasant. 3. Local plant shops. Visiting local plant shops can offer a hands-on experience and the opportunity to ask questions and receive personalized advice. 4. Botanical gardens. Botanical gardens offer a chance to see rare and exotic plant species in person and learn more about their care and maintenance. 5. Houseplant apps. There are many houseplant apps available that can help you identify plants, track watering schedules. Final thoughts. Houseplants have become an essential part of many people's lives. They offer numerous benefits, from purifying the air to boosting your mood and productivity. As you embark on your houseplant journey, remember that each plant is unique and requires individual attention. 
It's essential to learn about your plant's specific needs and adjust your care routine accordingly. Also, don't be afraid to experiment with different plants and techniques. Gardening is all about trial and error, so don't get discouraged if a plant doesn't thrive. Keep learning, keep growing, and most importantly, have fun with it.